Hey, what's up, family? Today we back in the stool with another video. Y'all already know we got the Supreme drop list to go over. It's official. There's retail prices out, as y'all can see on the screen, and I'm not gonna waste too much time. Leave a like if y'all end up enjoying this video. Subscribe to the channel. We're this close to 19.5. Yo, I'm about to start going hard. I know I low-key been sleeping on YouTube a little bit more. It's because I've been focusing on my Instagram more, but you feel me? I'm about to balance it out more. Hey, with all that being said, let's go ahead and get straight to it bro all the way at the top of the damn that shit sound like a fucking sports car hold up pause i hope y'all could hear this shit behind me bro one day i'm gonna have a crib with no background noise maybe that's just the filming side of me but fuck all that shit hold up pause bruh supreme got some craft mac and cheese coming out let's go ahead and talk about this in detail they got a whole mac and cheese supreme setup they went all out on this shit bro look at the letters in the fucking bowl that shit spells out supreme i ain't even know mac and cheese had details like that i thought it was just a fucking little macaroni with some cheese you feel me and it's not even real cheese but hey dino over here wearing the little bogo on it details bro. it's all about the details six dollars for one of these shits normally they let you cop like four or eight i don't know how this shit is gonna work but yeah this is us only eu boys are sick again they stay playing eu that shit is fucked but it is what it is us exclusive i guess craft mac and cheese if y'all interested hey supreme got you bro y'all probably gonna let this sit on a shelf i'm good on this we got the paint skateboard this one is sick as fuck probably one of my favorite skate decks i've seen in a minute it's almost the label that's around the paint can if you take that paper off that's what that shit will look like and the brand is supreme obviously it's simple but it's actually in detail if that makes sense i don't know how to explain it but this definitely looks fire and i feel like it would be a good display piece hey if you skate in these bitches then this shit would be hard too you feel me it depends on what your virtue is personally i would display this shit that's just me i feel like it's a fire skate deck 58 dollars is the retail on that it's probably one of my favorite decks that they've released so far or probably for the season to be honest i think this one's actually hard the first piece we knew was confirmed for this week was the magic ink markers they basically drop a set of markers every year or so but there's different brands every time they do it this time they're doing like this paint marker that's all i could really see right here i'm a fan of graffiti so this is up my alley i really am a fan of this let me know if y'all feeling these 48 dollars is the retail of this which is a little bit steep but at the end of the day it is eight markers normally Normally they go for like four or five dollars individually it's not that bad it's supreme they're gonna tax a little bit more that's just life but that shit might be octopus ink low-key we got these over dyed beanies 38 dollars these shits are a banger this is the same beanie that i had a giveaway going on for which speaking of there's gonna be another giveaway coming soon low-key yeah we got these six colors right here that green one is beautiful in my opinion i'm really fucking with that one baby blue which is nice as well and then honestly all these shits are kind of hard the white one reminds me of the dude from four brothers that got thrown in the ice water y'all know who i'm talking about it's like an all white beanie clean beanie 38 dollars not that bad it's about to be summer out here you might have to hold that shit we do got the stars arc hooded sweatshirt this one comes in six colors and i don't think it's that bad this shit ain't terrible i'm fucking with the olive color the black one is clean there's the nyx color which bro the nyx are so ass these days the gray with the carolina blue fire that shit looks hard i definitely am fucking with that if you pair it with like a pair of Jordans that are Carolina blue, boom, right there, fit. But we about to get up out of here. This is clean, $168 though. It is a little bit more, I'm assuming, because of the studded whatever the fucks that are in the letters. $10 ain't gonna make it or break it. We got the short sleeve pocket tee. This one was supposed to release last week, but we're seeing this shit come out again. Hey, there's like nine colors. The heather gray is clean. That light pale blue one is all right. The brown looks like an essential shirt. Then that one at the end. I don't know if that's gray or black but the one all the way like probably on top of me right here that one's not bad i fuck with that one this is decent you feel me i'm not spending 60 plus shipping on this so we're gonna go to the other side we got the rafia s logo six panel this hat almost looks like a tote bag material i don't know if it's the ikea tote bag let me know because this shit is looking type sus. It's looking like some shit that's gonna repel the water, whatever, yeah. It sounds like a tote bag to me. Let me know if this is the Ikea bag hat. Are y'all fucking with it? Tell me if that blue was a little deeper. It wouldn't look like an Ikea bag. Let me know in the comments. The rain not gonna get through to your head, but just know whoever's walking behind you knows the vibe of your hat. Just know that they know that shit's from Ikea low key. This shit looked like the Bravo Super 
supermarket coupon newspaper book. Tell me not, bro. Tell me not. This should look like everything is on sale for less than it should be, but you definitely gonna spend hella bread wherever you going, cause these shit's about to add up. There's a lot of shit going on this week. Imagine wearing this with the Ikea bag hat. That's a fit, bro. You dead ass going to the supermarket. You got your coupons and you got the fucking bag to take your shit in your house all in one like i'm about to get up out of here i would never never buy some shit like that like what would you wear that with let me know please let me know we got the hand crocheted sweater this shit is kind of hard why they gotta have all these stripes though bruh the multi-color one looks like you in a trans like low-key you're in a daze type thing the brown one is more my style because it's more muted the other one is just a little louder and i don't think that would fit in my wardrobe i still wouldn't even cop that shit i'm not gonna lie bro the stripes are fucking with my head like if it was a different like more curvy design but it literally looks like rectangles on a sweater and it's just too much bro like it's too much we got the regular jeans these are retailing at 168 and honestly again these were supposed to release before they never dropped but they're dropping this week five different colors i do kind of like that denim one it just looks like a 90s denim and that gray wash color both of those are kind of solid but i don't really fuck with the fit of supreme denim so that's what's gonna happen to that we do got the broken camo camp cap what does that even mean what's broken that ass like i'm good on camp caps in general i'm honestly just fucking with fitteds these days maybe like a trucker here and there i'm good on this shit too bro it's not terrible but nothing too special 48 dollar retail on that shit. i don't think almost anything is gonna have resell this week i don't even know if the macaroni and cheese gonna do too well maybe 20 dollars paint skate deck in another time i would say like a hundred dollar resell I feel like this is a beautiful skate deck, not gonna lie. The overdyed beanie, probably one of my favorite pieces releasing this week because it's so versatile. That greenish color is beautiful. That baby blue lilac almost color looks nice as well. Y'all already know how I feel about the Bravo Extra Supermarket right there. We good on that. We got the little tote bag hat. We good on that shit. These are all right, but I'm not really copping. Like those are kind of mid. The Michelin Ness quilted sports jacket. This one comes in three different colors. It literally looks like a jersey over a jacket the more i look at this shit it almost looks gimmicky i ain't really fucking with this shit up close this is the more passable one because it almost looks like varsity jacket vibes with the little things right here as far as this jacket goes i would honestly sleep on this shit i see why it's lower on the list this satin zip up work shirt is actually not that bad bro this shit is clean tell me this shit wouldn't be hard night out vegas little silky black zip up short sleeve satin you feel me it's hot as fuck it has to be all black hopefully the stripes are all black too there's like one little white stripe y'all know what i'm talking about that wouldn't be bad i feel like this would be clean in the black everything else doo doo there's these chino pants releasing in six colors there's three that have stars three that are just chilling the navy ones actually look like a clean pair of chinos like low-key some shit you'll wear with some nice little nice little simple white button up you feel me some type b then you got the other star ones which honestly no 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 the star like why I, I i don't know bro it's just not for me you feel me we got the corduroy shorts faux colors brown ones and the black ones actually look hard i don't know why but it gives me like 90s feels i feel like for the summertime i'm leaning towards the brown low key i feel like the brown matches more with the branding it's a little more subtle definitely a clean pair of shorts in those two colors now when you look to the left you see a mistake some shit that you just don't want like maybe it is just me but that plaid color who came here and said let's use a cream pair of shorts which mind you that would be hard as f with the design and just the cream logo and let's throw some fucking green orange blue and navy stripes with the plaid on this shit what who the f said yes to that color just that one right there terrible bro so we got the denim chore coat this one's coming out in four colors and it does look like these denim but if you look at these there's five colors the denim color included then down here there's no denim color that's probably the best color like what the f this jacket in the denim color would have been the best and they smooth not drop 
popping the denim colors. So I just be confused, bro. Like whoever did that and then those shorts that I just talked about, they need to choose like a whole new position. These shits are ass. The bottom eight of this shit is straight doo-doo, bro. Like these? No. And then this shit at the bottom with the black, that's decent. It's wraps for that shit. Like low key. The top part is the best, obviously. Let me know what you guys are going to be going for this week. That's pretty much it. Leave a like on this one if you did enjoy. Subscribe to the channel if you're new and would enjoy more of this type of content. With all that being said, I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Peace, stay up, and I'm out.